The CW Twin Cities presents See What's Now, your entertainment news source. Hey, is this Rooster and Butch? Yeah, we hear you. How's it going up there? Cold? Uh, it's actually like 30, so it's a heat wave. Oh, man, you guys, that, that, that ain't nothing <laughs> for you guys. The chickens are laying. Exactly. It was like negative 10 the last two weeks. Oh, so yeah. This is great. We're laying out. I know. <laughs> <It's> not, <laughs> getting a suntan. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Wearing your little guy, they sleeve the shirt today. <laughs> exactly. All right, so Rooster and Butch, I saw the pilot episode. Love it. Tell the viewers what they're going to see. Just gonna, you're going to see a condensed version of how Butch and I have done business for years and years. And it, uh, it's, it's about getting to know the people mm -hmm. and uh, putting them, we, all, we, we get out there and get it on. And then, and then we talk about the business at the tail end of it. But it's getting, it's, you know, basically you got to get to know the person first before you even decide you want to go in business with us. Yeah, definitely. And you guys are best friends and now doing the show together. Butch, why are you guys so tight? Well, I'll tell you what, uh, it, 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 it's a life journey experience with, with Rooster mm -hmm. and I. We've known each other for 40 years, thereabouts. And uh, one of the things that we're, we kind of pride ourselves in is the fact that we actually have real jobs, by the way. Yeah. And have had, you know, mm -hmm. our entire lives. This is not what we do now, but we, we, we live in West Texas and we're in the oil and gas business and we've been competitors, fierce competitors for the last 40 years uh, and still are to this day. But we've learned how to do that, fight fair, as Rooster often refers to, with integrity, and we've be become, you know, we've, we've been friends, and we're still friends, and he's my best friend in life, is now, and will be to the end. And that's, we're really proud of that, and that's something that we're trying to portray on this show, or, mm -hmm. con or convey to, to, to younger uh, entrepreneurs and business people, is that there is a better way, or there's a, there's a good way to do business and conduct yourself in business and in life. Yeah, and you can definitely, the chemistry definitely comes across in the show. It's very entertaining to see you guys play off of each other. And Rooster, uh, you are, of course, are Matthew McConaughey's brother. Yes, sir. You guys sound exactly the same. You have the same mannerisms. And you are a self-made millionaire. He's one of the biggest Hollywood stars. What is up with the gene pool in your family? I mean, come on, spread the wealth a little bit. To Man, take we didn't have, uh, we, hey, we didn't have nowhere else to go but up. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, very impressive. But I will say after watching the show, I don't really see you doing the, doing the Lincoln commercials quite as much. <laughs> Probably not. I mean, I might do an old Ford truck deal or something. I mean, yeah. you know, I mean. old beat up truck. Yeah. Yeah. Well, just for my, just for my, just because the voice is so spot on, can I get a little, all right, all right, all right. No, I gave that, and man, I'm telling you, I let Matt Damon have that. He, he tries so hard that I don't want to spoil, you know, kill his thunder or nothing, man. I gave that to him. All right. Sounds good. Already, well, I will already, say. Already. He got, Butch has got one. I'll do already, <laughs> already, already. <laughs> perfect. Perfect. I love it. And I will say, after seeing the show, as much as I would love to have you guys support a business that I could come up with, I would also be a little bit scared because the first uh, person that I saw uh, try to pitch a company to you guys, you guys told him that he was going to have to jump from 10,000 feet up in the air. I mean, is harassing these people part of the deal? I mean, they got to earn their stripes. Well, just What's to up? see, it, 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 you know, it, it's just to see kind of how if they're all, how bad you want it, how committed are you? Mm -hmm. You know, we're not going to make you do something that you don't want to do. But it's kind of like, mm -hmm. you know, we, sure we've had people back off, but it's not we wouldn't mm -hmm. do anything to anybody that we wouldn't do to ourselves. Okay. Well, you and, know, you, we've coined tell, tell them our saying. You've coined a saying here, which really describes it. It's not what you. Oh, it's it's not. It's not, it's not what you make, it's what you're made of. And that's actually came from one of the, the head of A&E and, and the rascal. Mm -hmm. You know, I wish I'd have come up with it, but I got to give him credit. I love it. So for people, for up and coming entrepreneurs, you guys have been there, done that. What's the key to success to, to doing what you guys have done? Talk about Rooster and I, our, yeah. the key to our success, perseverance. Okay. Perseverance. You know, perseverance. I mean, we listen. It hadn't been all roses all along the, our journey through life and business. Mm -hmm. uh, in West Texas, in, in the business we're in, we have real high, real really good highs and really terrible bad lows. And if you don't, if you don't, you know, plan your P's and Q's just right, those lows will take you out. And Rooster, Rooster can attest to that. I'm the I'm the one that knows what not to do, because <laughs> I've done it all. <laughs> okay. I've 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 had a, quite a few you know, mishaps here and there. All right. Well, 
Rooster and Butch. It airs Wednesdays at 9 p.m. on A&E. Rooster and Butch, thank you very much for being with us. Thank you, John. Thank you for having us, John.